Hello and welcome back to G Security. So it's been a while since I uploaded a video, probably like three weeks ago. So I'm back again, and in this video today we are, I'm going to introduce you to a tool called Ghost, a tool that you can use to do exploitation of Android devices and specifically through ADB or the Android Debug Bridge. So. The first thing is to go to GitHub. We can do Ghost. GitHub. I think the tool is made by Antisec. And uh, it's here, right here. You can right click on it. So uh, basically, what we are going to do today is we are going to gather a uh, uh, the devices around the world that have the ADB port open and we are going to do that using Shodan to uh, to find devices around the world that have the ADB port open that is port 5555 then we are going to use Ghost to try and access the devices so the thing is today I'm not going to literally access those devices but what you can do you can try to uh, to enable the Android debug bridge interface on your Android phone, you can do that by going to your settings. You can just search on online for your specific device. You then turn on the. If you go to develop options, you can you have the option to enable the Android debugging. Then after that, just grab the IP address, and I will show you later how you can connect to that address. So I'm in the Ghost framework here. Uh, we are told that the Ghost framework is an Android post exploitation framework that exploits the Android debug bridge to remotely access an Android phone. So installation is fairly easy. Just grab the, you can use pip3 to install it. Uh, I already have it installed. It. You can do sudo, then paste it, and then enter. So just going to overwrite the the existing installation then uh, we are just going to run the tool sudo ghost and there it is the ghost framework and its version 8.0 by ntsec and then we are greeted by this ghost prompt it's just waiting for a target now we can go to showdown Shodan.io. So I already did a video on Shodan. And what we can do here, we can go and search for the Android debug bridge. And what Shodan will do, will try to gather all devices around the world that have the port 555 open. And that is the Android debug bridge. And there it is. We have 17,000 results. And most of them are located in the United States. So... We can try to, let me open this one in a new tab. So all these devices that you can see here, all these IP addresses have the Android debug bridge open. That is port 455 open. So we can grab this IP address. So we'll just assume this is our phone. Okay, you can do connect, then paste the IP there. But I'm not going to do the exploit, the actual exploitation, or try to gain access to that device. But what you can do, as I already told you earlier, is you can enable the Android debug bridge on your phone, then paste the IP address of your Android phone there, and then try to see all the features of the Ghost framework and everything that you can do with Ghost. So. Uh, this is just, just a simple tutorial on how you can use Ghost to do exploitation of the Android debug bridge. So if you are not doing any uh, development uh, work, I, it, there's no need for you to actually open port 555 on your phone because just like that, Shodan will be able to pick your IP address so 
you may probably these people like this guy in Spain has no idea maybe we can actually see his public IP and such kind of information so thank you guys for passing by and watching this video please if you really like the video subscribe like and share more and more videos are on the way thank you and god bless